Hey everyone, it's Libby from Meister Tarot. I'd like to acknowledge the Waramai First Nations people on whose traditional lands these videos are made. And welcome to you, your guides, my guides and universal energy. It's absolutely fabulous to have you along with me. Okay, woke up this morning, read the news and nearly cried with frustration uh, about the recess uh, being called in the Bragg case. Now, the recess isn't until Monday next, uh, Tuesday next week, uh, the 4th of April, and then they will resume, they said, the end of April. So I'm getting, a lot of the media is saying a month, but I'm getting that it's going to be a two-week recess. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. But I'm going to have a look at it because it's not recessed yet. Um, but I read the other week, and you've got to remember, <laughs> the universe does not have a calendar. Um, and it works in the time that it needs to work in. Now, I read, um, I read was it last week, about the fact that this new, um, well, it's not a new witness, but... Uh, I found out it's a new witness, but they did have another witness on Monday and there was a lot of speculation about who was it, who was it. Nobody knew for ages. And then it's been revealed that it's David Pecker. David Pecker from the National Enquirer was the Monday witness. Now, the guys were very adamant that there was more information that was brought forward um, that the prosecutors needed to chase down. Oh boy, come on. Okay, so I'm going to have a look um, at what David Pecker had to reveal. Oh, and where does it go from this? Because, okay, so David Pecker, um, he apparently, he has testified before, but he was brought back after the, was it the Costello? I did write it down. Yes, the Costello testimony because there's so many that I, it's hard to keep track. Uh, after the Costello testimony, he was brought back because he was involved in helping uh, Trump to make the payments. Okay, now what's come out is Trump has made a claim. <clears throat> right, so that first statement, how do you tell something's a lie? Trump makes a claim. Trump claimed that... Um, the Bragg case has been dropped. No, it hasn't. But you know it's going to be a lie as soon as as soon as a statement comes out that Trump claimed. Uh, oh gosh, wasn't it hilarious? Trump claim, claiming that somebody must have hacked and put in the photograph of the baseball bat after he had posted uh, his very fine and positive <laughs> um, uh, statement that he made about the Bragg case. Oh, goodness me. Oh, it must have been put there by the papers. Oh goodness me! Uh, he can't keep up with his can't keep up with his lies. That's the problem with lying is you can't you have to try and remember what you lied about last week <laughs> to be able to continue continue the lie. And very disappointed in the wake of Nashville is that North Carolina have voted that a permit is no longer required to purchase a handgun. Oh man, where does this end? Okay. It will end, but it is going to be slow, and it is not nothing's going to happen uh, until uh, after 2024. Oh, thank you guys, prickly prickly. Okay, so what I'm going to have a look at is I'm going to have a look at um, David Pecker. Ba David Pecker's testimony. I'm using my gilded tarot royale. Uh, Trump's lawyer, Takapina, old tacos. Uh, came out and claimed that there shouldn't be a case against Trump, which is absolute BS. Uh, it's not about paying uh, Stormy Daniels, not about paying a, a porn star, it's about money fraud, it's about uh, falsifying uh, tax records, it's, yeah, it's nothing to do with... I mean, it is that he paid Stormy Daniels, but it's not the fact that he... Tommy Daniels, if that makes sense. So let's have a look. What was the information that, that David Pecker brought forward? Ah, oh, ha, 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 abuse of power. Absolutely flung out. The stealing of the truth. 
I don't think this is David Pecker. This is information that David, because that was the question. What information did David Pecker bring forward? Abuse of power, stealing of the truth. Okay. Good first card. Happy for that one. Okay, let's have a look. Now, if my voice sounds a little bit different, uh, I'm missing a back tooth. Um, my crown goes on in another couple of weeks, but my tongue isn't used to it. The temporary crown uh, hmm, fell off. <laughs> wasn't wasn't unhappy to see that go. Um, so yeah, if I sound a little bit funny, I do apologise. Okay, David Pecker, David Pecker, David Pecker. What? What information did David Pecker bring forward? The National Enquirer, a Murdoch... Uh, this is interesting. Okay. What I just heard was that um, Murdoch... So when he gave his first testimony, Trump was still in favour with Murdoch. But Murdoch has since told... Pecker, or however the powers that be in the Murdoch Empire, that's why Pecker's come back. There's been a change in testimony, okay, is what I'm hearing, because there's a change in the attitude from up on high. Okay, show me, guys, show me the information, entertainment only, show me what David Pecker brought forward, what David Pecker brought forward, David Pecker brought forward those cards, yeah, okay, thank you, right, come on down, we'll try and whip through this quickly, ooh, 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 this is a real dramatic, I'd say he's 180 degreed on his testimony is what I'm getting, Death is about a significant ending and new beginning. Oh boy. Okay, my gut, my tummy is clenching at this card. Uh, if you think about the traditional rider weight deck, it is about the king being trampled under the horse uh, with his crown falling off and a new dawn for the new arising. So this is about a really significant change in direction change in leadership wow okay challenged by the abuse of power card again sabotage betrayal deception stealing uh, leaving your comrades on the field um, while you snick off with all the weaponry um, so yeah he's had he oh, okay Okay, entertainment only, and I'm really, really, really hoping my guides are right in this, and this is why it's being delayed. Sorry, I had a big dramatic, this is why it's being delayed, is because he's had a huge dramatic turn on the information that he's brought forward. Okay, right, right. Information, a message coming forth about overseas influences. Ooh, wow. Okay, this is also, so this is the foundation of this reading. I'm asking about the information that David Pecker brought forward. This is about something coming in from overseas. A culmination of a plan. Wow. Okay. Can be, you know, a culmination of a plan full stop. But this, the, yeah, okay. The foundation of this reading. In the past, walking away from what no longer serves. As as the truth, as the emotional truth is exposed by the moon is what I'm getting. Now really interesting, even though this is the Eight of Cups, this figure is holding a staff which reminds me of the wands. And this is about looking at what was is being exposed by the moon and the moon exposes the uh, truth being brought to the surface and this figure has turned its back and is and is preparing to walk away and that's in the past okay uh -huh. 
crowning this reading, the brag, the brag case, the legal system, the Attorney General, the Attorney General's office. I've just redrawn to this one in the three cups that have fallen over. There is this, the, the, uh, if you think about the five of cups, there are three cups fallen over, three cups fallen over as well. It's reminding me about of the five of cups, the lost disappointment um, uh, um, and feeling of betrayal. And this figure then has the three cups again fallen over but is walking away. Here we have the Attorney General's office at the crowning of this reading. Could be the DOJ as well. I'm thinking there's information come out here that is of interest to uh, the DOJ as well, is what my boys are telling me. And, and that's why it's the brakes have been hit. Okay, going forward, Ten of Cups. The end of a cycle, bringing in of the harvest. In the immediate future. The voter. Hmm, let's see where this goes. But it, being a tenant is the end of the cycle, end of emotional cycle. Love the rainbow behind it. But these two, you've got these two figures in the foreground conversing with each other as they, oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh boy. All oh, right, yeah, the, the, I got the yes, look at them. The two figures in the, in the centre conversing over what they have in their baskets. So this is jury deliberation as well, coming to an end. I don't know that they're going to have, yeah, well, I'll ask. I don't know whether they're going to have a decision before the recess or whether it's going to happen afterwards. We'll keep going. So this is the information that David Peck has brought forward. Externally, the Queen of Pentacles. Uh, this is she's bringing forward new information about. Thank you. Homeland Security. That's why it's. That's why it's taken. Yeah. Now, if you remember last week, I said there's something big coming forward that they need to run down. They need to run it down. This is this is big. Okay, internally, wheel of fortune. The wheel of fortune, karma turning, destiny turning, um, karma coming and biting on the bum type thing. This is internally. This this is a significant card to be in the internal in regards to the information. This isn't David Pecker. This is the information he brought forward. This is a real turning point information. Okay. Page of Cups in the hopes and fears. Something. Oh, I don't know whether these cards can get any more. OMG, uh, something really unexpected coming out of left field being presented that even an old cynic like me is going to go, what the F? Um, yes, yeah, something really unexpected brought forward from this information that David Pecker has presented. One of my oh gorgeous, gorgeous um, viewers had said something about, um, oh, what did they say? They said something about information coming forward that's going to be really surprising and they did actually say a couple of things uh, that are going to be surprising. Can't even, I can't remember, I should have, I'm sorry about that <laughs> for whomever wrote it. But yeah, there is something really unexpected going to come forward out of this, this David Pecker information. The outcome, Nine of Swords, Anxiety. We've got the owl looking through the window, the owl of wisdom. But there's a lot of anxiety over this information. <gasps> Trump knows. Trump knows what that, what that information is and that's why he lashed out with the brag baseball bat 
and that's why he's declaring the case has been closed. It hasn't been closed. That's why he's got his lawyers saying that there shouldn't be a case. He's really anxious about this. This is, this is, this is truth coming forward that is um, quite nightmarish. Okay. Ooh. Stormy, stormy, stormy. But there's truth coming forward that's quite nightmarish is what I'm getting. That's going to bring about an ending and loss disappointment. Here's this Five of Cups that is hinted at in this Eight of Cups. An emotional, a significant emotional loss as information is brought forward. The Queen of Cups has got something in her cup to be revealed. So we've got the Page, Knight, Queen of Cups. They're all bringing information forward. And then the hermit lighting the path in the dark. But the path does have obstacles in it. Obstacles, but the light is shining on the obstacles in the path. And then we have the truth, six of swords, truth being packed up and moved, moved forward, movement forward. On the base we have the magician. Strength, tower, star. Four major arcana on the base. This is about um, the manipulation, the strength and the exposure of the ma manipulation that is going to bring a, around about a tower moment. Uh, and you've got the crown up the top here being being um, blown off the ivory tower. The star, which is the star of hope, the star of, uh, of, of goodness, the star of faith, the star of um, uh, uh, just all that is good about the US democracy. It's, it's not, democracy is never great, but it is the best system there is at the moment. Um, and just proven in Australia with the New South Wales election where we just voted in our, uh, our um, progressive government. Hopefully they'll be progressive. Um, but yeah, this is, this is the best of the United States. What if we keep going? There is something financially, Four of Pentacles, that certain people are wanting to be kept hidden about money laundering, the giving and receiving of money, loans and debts with the Six of Pentacles. We have the prosecutors here and very potentially something to do with Russia or Saudi or, um, or bringing forth something new is what my boys are telling me. It's a very complicated card, this one. Uh, bringing forward something quite powerful that is new. Okay, I'm going to leave that there. I don't think I need to go further with that. That was the, that's about the information. I, I can't give you a time. I'll just have a quick look with Pendulum. I haven't used Pendulum for a while, but we'll have a quick look. Just bring it down. They're wanting a longer string. Right, thank you. Guys, can I ask a question? Can I ask a question, please? Can I ask a question? Will we hear anything more in the Bragg case prior to the recess? Well, that's probably the wrong question because it's a sort of. Will the jury bring down charges before the recess. Will the jury bring down charges before the recess? Yeah, that's a no. Can I ask a question, please? Is it because David Pecker's testimony? Is it because of David Pecker's testimony? And that's a yes. There's, there's something. There's something really big 
in that testimony. Oh, man. And Trump knows it. Trump knows it. Expect, okay, expect in the next two weeks. Shut the noise out. That's what I'm getting. Don't listen to him. Anything that starts with Trump said, Trump claims, Trump's lawyer said, blah, 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 straight out lie is what I'm being told to tell you. So don't don't enter into that energy at all because if you enter into that energy, you are giving it power. Just know straight up anything that comes out that Trump said, Trump's lawyer said, whatever, straight out lie. Okay. <laughs> right. Thank you, guys. That was interesting. I shall, if nothing is happening overnight, I will have a break tomorrow uh, and see you on Sunday, but we'll see how it plays out. Thank you for joining me. Take care. Love to you all.